Yo guys, what is going on? It's the Captain. Captain Shakes here, Call of Duty's number one player with Tourette Syndrome. And guess what? It's Camp Week, guys. It is Camp Week here on the channel. Now, first off, those of you who are new or just coming back to the channel who have maybe been subscribed for a while, you know I don't camp. So what I what did I do? I had to get some gameplay by the Call of Duty's number one camper, Saken Mad Raj, baby. Saken, my boy, he's follows me on Twitter, I follow him, we're, we're becoming really good dudes. He's a really good guy and he knows how to camp. So, the gameplays you are going to, going to be seeing during camp week are going to be by Mr. Saken himself. Um, and this gameplay, he goes off, he goes flawless, and actually manages to get a double, double, double ball turret gunner and he also gets the V2 rocket. So I am going to give you some great tips, some great tips that he has shared on his channel that he has given to me and how to be a good camper. So this is episode one. And during the week, we're going to talk about the best score streaks to use, the best plat setups, class setups to use, and the best game modes and the maps to camp on the best spots. I'm going to be bringing that all to you during camp week. And then the second week, we're going to have passive week where we learn how to play passive. So tip number one, guys, find that spot. Find that sweet spot. Find that spot on the map that you know you're going to rack a lot of kills and not die a lot. There's always that one spot on each map, on any map, on your favorite map, on your worst, most hated map. There's always that one spot that you know you're going to go to and you know that you're going to rack up the kills and not rack up the deaths, if you know what I'm saying. Now this could, you know, this could be power positions. This could be in the back of the map. Um, this could be in, you know, the right side of the map if you're protecting A. If you're protecting C, this could be camping in the middle of the map and protecting B. It all depends on what spot you want to patrol and you want to keep locked down on that map. So guys, you need to find that certain spot on that map. And I know Saken has videos on his channel. Um, on, I believe he's covered every single map in the game on the best camping spots in the game I will be doing a short video on the best camping spots on each map all in one video So stay tuned for that one now tip number two and this is very important guys use the double s mine and replenish him what I mean by that is uh, use expeditionary what that gives you is it gives you double lethal and it gives you double tactical You know, we don't really care about the tactical in this situation because you know tacticals won't you know They could give you kills, but more necessary the lethals will get you the kills and you, you're gonna want to be rocking those double s mines guys And you're also gonna re replenish from killed enemies so every time you kill an enemy, either with this, you know, by that S miner or a gun, you want to go over their body to get an S miner and put it back in the same exact spot. As you see in this gameplay, what Saken is doing, you know, he's on USS Texas. He's got this spot locked down. He managed to drop double, double ball turret gunners and a V2 rocket. And you know, and most of the most of the time, his S mines are doing the work. I mean, he got a ball turret gunner with maybe one or two gun kills, and the rest were S mines. And the thing with camping is once you kill someone and they know where you are and you know where they're, you know, where they know where you're camping, they're going to come at you 99% of the time and you're always going to have the upper advantage on them. The third tip, guys, use Blitzkrieg. Blitzkrieg is very important. Uh, Saken is using Blitzkrieg in this gameplay. And what Blitzkrieg does is it basically gives you, it turns score streaks into kill streaks. So you get your kill streaks just for kills. So this allows you to play game modes like Domination. This allows you to play game modes like Capture the Flag, where Saken is playing right now. This allows you to play Kill Confirmed and not worry about mean and playing the objective so much because, I mean, a camper usually does not play the objective all too much. They just camp for kills. Well, Blitzkrieg will turn those score streaks into kills. You will get your kill streaks much faster. You don't have to worry about capping. You don't have to worry about collecting tags. Uh, you know, the best camper is a camper that camps and plays the objective. Saken does play objective, um, but we all know, you know, we all know those type of players that camp just for kills. So using Blitzkrieg is important. Number four, always be aware, guys. Uh, as you can see, Saken right now, he's, you know, Saken is locked down in, you know, this area in USS Texas, and he's watching both doorways. He's watching the windows. He's watching the back of the map. He's watching the spawn. He's just not ADSing at a doorway. Now, a good camper 
is, will do what Saken is doing. He will watch all the entryways. He will make sure that you do not get in. A bad camper will just sit in the corner and ADS at one entryway, whether it be a door, whether it be a staircase. And most of the time, they will get picked off by where they're not looking at. So, Destin, define, de certify yourself as a good camper or a bad camper. Uh, if you're a bad camper and you see yourself getting killed by, you know, stuff like getting killed from the different area or, you know, just don't, basically what I'm trying to say is don't just sit in the corner and ADS at one spot. Make, be always aware, be always aware of, be aware of your surroundings, check your corners, check behind you, check in front of you. Number five, be patient. And this is why I can't camp. This is why Captain Shakes can't camp. It's the ADHD in me. I just cannot camp. I can't be patient. I am the type of player that runs and guns, that just wants to be in their spawn, that just wants to be in the middle of the map, that just wants to be in power positions, that just wants to get kills. You know, Saken, he's very patient, as you can see in this gameplay. He knows where to look. He knows when to shoot. He's very patient. He, does, he doesn't really push up, especially when he's streaking. And that's another thing. With, when you're streaking and you're one or two off of a big score streak, kill streak, do not rush up. More, more than likely, you will die. That's the problem I have. But be patient, guys. Let the game come to you. Let the enemies come to you. Like I said, if you're camping and you, and you kill them and they get killed by you and they know where you are, 9 out of 10 times, they're going to rush to you in the same exact spot. So you're going to be get the kill. You're going to have the upper advantage on them 9 out of 10 times. So be patient. Number 6. Watch the minimap and HUD. Now, if you're playing hardcore, you don't have a mini map the best mini map for you is the HUD watch your teammates look at their gamer tags look at their PSN names watch the mini map watch the obituary see where they die if you know that you just saw them and they died well the enemies are pretty close and if you have a mini map on watch to see where your teammates are dying watch to see where the enemies are at the mini map and core is your best friend and the HUD and hardcore not the HUD, the, uh, the obituary, the, um, the, the kill feed, I guess you can call it. And Hardcore is your best friend, guys. So, looking at this gameplay, Saken. Saken destroys everyone. I believe, he, I mean, he almost drops a 50 KD in this gameplay. Like I said, he drops multiple ball turret gunners, and he drops that V2 rocket. Uh, so, definitely watch this gameplay. Take some tips. Go check out his channel. And like I said, I will be covering all aspects on camping throughout the week on my channel. So, please stay tuned for that. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Make sure you hit the notification bells to be alerted whenever I go live and whenever I upload. We are live every single night at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I do almost pretty much a giveaway almost every stream, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that. Let's see if we can drop 40 likes on this. And like I said, this is the first episode on my camp week. We are going to give you all the best camping tips. And all these gameplays are going to be most likely by Saken unless I can get one. So I hope you enjoy, guys. Stay cool, fool. Don't hate. Eat some cake, thick thighs, and bright eyes. And as always, guys, keep on grinding.